Welcome back to Carson Tate's video log. I'm standing here in Palm Springs where it's um, growing cloudy, but that's okay because it's been really, really sunny all day and we could use the break. Um, I'm here with Katrina, reader extraordinaire, and you're here to visit the festivities, yes? I'm here for the book fest. All right, so you attended what last night? The library thing? The library readings, and I was late this morning to the first reading from 11 to 1 because I was hungover, but I made it <laughs> before it was... You know, did a little drinking last night so to celebrate being here. So there's some fun to be had in Palm Springs. Yeah, yeah, this is my first year. I know you guys have been doing this two or three years. Absolutely. This is, my this, first is year. this is the fourth time. So how'd you hear about it? Um, on the Bold Strokes website. So you're a Bold Strokes fan? I'm a Bold Strokes fanatic. I love that. Let's do a Bold Strokes cheer. One, two, three. We're gonna go Bold Strokes. Okay. One, two, three. Bold, bold Strokes! <laughs> Yeah, love it. Love it. <laughs> All right, so what's important about these kind of events rather than just reading about authors online or reading books? Well, because uh, I'm not just a, a book fan, you know, I'm a movie fan, I'm a music fan. And to meet the people that create the entertainment that you enjoy is a big thrill. Well, And I've wanted to come before, but things happen, but I made it this year. And I was telling somebody today, it's like hanging out with your favorite rock stars. I mean, you guys are our rock stars. Because most of the people that read these books don't just read them. We're, we're, I'm a fanatic. I go, I, I check the website, what's being released, when it's released. I save my money like a good girl, and I run to the books and I buy five at a time, you know, and it ain't cheap, you know, no, I, I, I would rather be buying my Jack Daniels, but I put it aside <laughs> when I get the release date, you know, and I don't just read one off, I, I have a lot of friends that just read one off, I have a, a friend that's a Radcliffe fanatic and she won't read anybody else, really? and I give her, I'm like, no, you gotta try this, I'm, I'm not kidding, she will only be, but I read anybody with a good plot that turns good. Excellent, well, as an author, I can tell you that there's nothing better than to come to these events and have people attend, and it makes us feel so good. Does it really? Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. What if we had a party and nobody came? Yeah. But, but so, but what's it like to to write and write and write and finally meet the fans and hear what they have to say? Does it freak you out or you enjoy it? No, or? it's pretty awesome because it's a balance. You know, like you're writing in a room all by yourself, yeah. you know, like in your little tiny place, and then you finally get to come out and socialize and meet people. And that, to me, is one of the best things of all. Did she just turn this interview around? Yeah. I thought so. <laughs> Because, well, it's great the way you do it, but sometimes as a fan, you're sitting there and you're chomping at the bit, and you don't just want to pull people to the side and talk. You want to stand up and go, but, 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 and there's no time. So this is my chance to ask stuff. I didn't, you know. Absolutely. Well, we're so glad you came, and thanks for taking the time. And I know it costs money, and I don't want you to miss out on your Jack Daniels. Can you say that on the Yeah, we could say it. We just take, take, take our clothes off. <laughs> would not want to scare people with that anyway. No, thanks, Katrina. So I appreciate it. Thank All right, you. Carson Tate, video log. Rock.